a USB 4 dock. And on the left, on the screen, we're actually doing a very complex receiver testing, but it's fully automated. So all I got to do is kick back and watch the test run. And let's take a look at the, uh, what the test results uh, would look like. So this is the uh, test results of this automated test. And all we're looking for is right here, which is zero. We're looking for a BR of zero. So in this entire complex setup, we're looking for a zero, which means that we are doing good. And on the right over here, we're doing the same thing uh, on the transmitted test. In addition to that, we're doing a return loss test with this ENA. But that's not all. Way to right here, so we actually have a piece of Synopsys USB 4 IP we are testing. So the inputs are going to here and you see this wonderful eye, a very wide open eye that easily passed the test. But more important than that, what I'd like to show you here is that these results show the correlation between Keysight simulation software and a final product. From the left, before you even turn your silicon, you have to know, does it work? Before you invest anything. And this is simulation result. And at the very end, when you finally have a product that you're measuring on a physical layer, which is that board that you see here, you can see a perfect correlation between simulation in the very beginning to us finally testing the physical product at the very end.